Welcome. Hi, Elizabeth. Hey. Thank you so much for bringing Koshka. And Koshka is a three-year-old domestic short-haired female. And um, I am not sure of her exact weight. Um, so some of her personality traits are independent, curious, and smart. And I could see this beautiful cat. <laughs> wow. Thank you for your time. Thank you for fostering this cat and uh, for giving her a beautiful, loving home until she finds a forever home. And uh, just a couple of questions for you. I could see she's playing with that ball. And uh, what was Koshka like when she arrived? And what did the settling look like for her? So we've had Koshka for quite a while. She came back to us um, from her original adopter with some behavioral issues that we had to work through. Um, so initially she was much more independent. Um, and then she's like kind of slowly over the last year that we've had her is opened up. She's a bit more cuddly, more friendly, um, seeks out much more affection. I can see. Wow. She's absolutely beautiful. And uh, may I ask, what do you think? Would Koshka be better suited in a household where she would be the only cat or where other cats are present and why? Um, so she does play a little rough with other cats we've uh, figured out. So she would probably be best in a home with an only, as an only pet. Okay. And can you describe us a typical day, Koshka's typical day? What does it look like? Yeah. Um, so my roommate and I both work from home. So we wake up probably around like six or seven um, and then she, uh, she gets fed shortly after that around eight um, and then she spends the next couple hours sitting in my windowsill meowing and chattering at the birds um, and then she'll settle down in a spot of sunshine and go to sleep for most of the rest of the day. She'll get up and like move spots a couple times but most of the time she curls up and goes to sleep um, and then around six or so she starts looking for dinner um and yeah uh and then she's pretty quiet the rest of the night and uh if you would ask koshka about her ideal home what would it look like what do you think she would say what type of home would she like um she definitely like to have her own person that uh knows her routine feeds her on time all of that um definitely around for some snuggles um, but also like totally fine to leave her alone when she wants to be left alone. I see. And, um, if you would compare that's for a fun question to help us get to know her a little bit better, how does she like to play? I can see she likes this. Um, she likes this toy. And if you would compare her to a celebrity, who would it be in terms of temperament, personality? Um, uh, so this one was a tough one. Uh, I'll echo, uh, I think whoever had mentioned that before. Um, but I definitely, I think, um, probably I'm going to go with Britney Spears, um, just cause she had a bit of a rough start and she's definitely a drama queen. Um, but she's got her <laughs> life together now and she's, <laughs> she's on track to, uh, to be doing pretty well. I see. Thank you so much. And is there anything else that is important for a potential adopter to know about Koshka that we haven't, that I haven't asked you or haven't mentioned? Um, so one fun thing about Koshka is she is um, clicker trained. So she knows Target um, with like this wooden spoon. So she'll go up and touch her nose to it. Um, and then she also sort of knows sit. So she's got a couple of tricks underneath her belt. Oh, that is really, really cool. Thank you so much um, for sharing that with us. Those are all very important things for a potential adopter to know. And thank you for bringing Koshka today and providing a loving home for her while she finds a forever home. And if anybody is interested in adopting Koshka, your website to go to would be bit.ly backslash adopt Koshka. 